Good morning, everyone. What is the worth of your wealth? What is the value of your inheritance? You know, you are working hard every day. Some people work for 12 hours, 8 hours, 14 hours. You put your life into risk to work. And you are working hard every day to save something for your children and family. Sometimes people will not respect you and consider your hard work. You may be sacrificing your life to bring some kind of wealth to your family. But people mistreat you, disrespect you, and they don't even honor your hard work. They don't regard your sweat. Here is the prophecy in Genesis chapter 17, verse 8, that God gave to Abraham. Abraham walked so many days in order to bring inheritance for Isaac, for Jacob and the descendants. And let's see what is the prophecy for Abraham in Genesis chapter 17, verse 8. And it says, Also, I give to you and your descendants after you the land in which you are a stranger, all the land of Canaan as an everlasting possession, and I will be their God. That's the blessings and that's the prophecy that as Abraham was standing empty-handed, he didn't have any land at the moment. But God said, I will give the land of Canaan and you will inherit it, you will possess it and I will be your God as well. You know, God is our freedom. I will be with you. God said to Abraham, we may have so much things, but God is with you. In spite of your hard work, in spite of all your sweat, remember God is with you. Our God is our freedom. Our God is our wealth. When Abraham was a sojourn, moving place to place, God said, you don't have to be a sojourn. I will give you inheritance and I will be your God. People may disrespect, people may forsake you, but you don't have to worry about it. Though family forsakes you, though your friends don't understand you, though your own siblings or your own spouse sometime dishonor you, but remember God is there to bless your descendants to bless your inheritance, to bless your hard work, and to bless your saves. And in Philippians, God says, chapter 4, verse 19, He says, And my God shall supply all your need according to His riches in glory by Christ Jesus. If you are suffering of anything, here is the blessings. That God will supply all your needs as God blessed Abraham, gave the land, gave house, gave carols. God will bless you as well according to his riches and glory. And today, the blessings and the prophecy is God is your freedom. God is in your inheritance. He will not forsake you nor leave you. Let us pray. Our Father, we thank you for the assurance that you gave it to Abraham. So also, dear Lord, be with us and help us, encourage us to move forward in spite of pandemic, in spite of crisis. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. Have a blessed day.